Assalamu alaikum. Hello, everybody. It's me, your host, Muhammad Mitwali, and today with a skill 34, use have and had correctly. Two tenses that are often confused are the present perfect have plus past participle and the past perfect had plus past participle. These two tenses have completely different uses. And you should understand how to differentiate them. The present perfect have plus past participle refers to a period of time from the past until the present. For example, Sue has lived in Los Angeles for 10 years. This sentence means that Sue has lived in Los Angeles for the 10 years up to now. According to this sentence, Sue is still living in Los Angeles. Because the present perfect refers to a period of time from the past until the present, it is not correct in a sentence that indicates past only. At the start of the 19th century, Thomas Jefferson has become President of the United States. Every time Jim worked on his car, he has improved it. In the first example, the phrase at the start of the 19th century indicates that the action of the verb was in the past only but the verb indicates the period of time from the past until the present. Since this is not logical, the sentence is not correct. The verb in the first example should be the simple past became. The second example indicates that Jim worked on his car in the past, but he improved it in the period from the past until the present. This idea also is not logical. The verb in the second example should be the simple past improved. The past perfect had plus past participle refers to a period of time that started in the past and ended in the past before something else happened in the past. Sue had lived in Los Angeles for 10 years when she moved to San Diego. This sentence means that Sue lived in Los Angeles for 10 years in the past before she moved to San Diego in the past. She no longer lives in Los Angeles. Because the past perfect begins in the past and ends in the past, is generally not correct in the same sentence with the present tense. Tom had finished the exam when the teacher collects the papers. This sentence indicates that Tom finished the exam in the past and that action ended when the teacher collects the papers in the present. This is not logical. So the sentence is not correct. Tom finished the exam in the past and the action of finishing the exam ended when the teacher collected the papers. Therefore, the second verb in this example should be in the past tense, collected. The following chart outlines the uses of the present perfect and the past perfect. Using have plus past participle and had plus past participle. The tense present perfect have plus past participle. The past up to now, that's the meaning and the use not with past tense. For the past perfect, the form is had plus past participle and the meaning something in the past before another past action up to the past and the use not with present tense except when the time expression sense is part of the sentence this two asterisks shows here that there is an exception to use the present perfect with the past tense only when you have sense for example when you say I haven't seen him that's present perfect since we met last year in this case the meaning of the word since expresses the meaning of up to now. Exercise 34. Each of the following sentences contains had or have. Underline the verbs twice and decide if the meaning are logical. Then indicate if the sentence are correct C or incorrect I. 3. The students have registered for classes before the semester started. The student's subject have registered verb before connector the semester is the other subject and started is the verb so have registered present perfect that happened in the past and up to now but they did this action before this action happened so this is the first action and it cannot be the first action in present perfect and the second action past simple so it's wrong so this one should be the students registered three is incorrect Four. When she had purchased the car, she contacted the insurance agent. When she had purchased the car, 
she contacted the insurance agent when is a connector she is the subject had purchased is past perfect verb she is another subject and contacted this is the verb first you purchase a car after that you contact it and what comes first is past perfect like here past perfect came first and then past simple comes after past perfect so the sentence is correct five he said that he had finished the typing when you finish the reports he said subject verb that is a connector he subject had finished is the verb when is a connector you finish subject and verb and as you can see here he said is not a problem because generally you say something that happened in the past so we're not going to take this because it's kind of a pertinent speech so let's go from here had finished that something happened in the past not only the past the past before something else and to link it with something that happens in the present it's illogical this sentence totally illogical so it's incorrect five is incorrect it should be when you finished the reports if you need to correct it six she has enjoyed herself every time that she has gone to the zoo she subject has enjoyed is the present perfect verb that connector she has gone to the zoo these two verbs are in the same tense present perfect and present perfect which can be okay because they can match six is correct seven he drove to the post office after he had finished preparing the package he subject drove verb after connector his subject had finished verb and this is very logical why because you drove this is past simple it happened after past perfect that means past perfect happened first which is very correct eight after the votes were counted it had been determined that Steve was the winner after connector the vote subject were counted verb it a subject had been determined this is the passive past perfect verb that connector Steve this is the subject was the verb after the votes were counted that means this first happened this first happened because after this came past perfect it doesn't work like that generally past perfect all the time happens before past simple it could be after the votes had been counted it was determined because to put past perfect in the real action generally happens before past simple okay so you first count the votes and then you know who is the winner that's why this sentence is incorrect nine last night all the waiters and waitresses have worked over time all the waiters and waitresses this is the subject have worked this is a present perfect and it's incorrect because I said last time which is absolute past I cannot use present perfect with past simple it's wrong because it refers to the past then he had fastened his seat belt before the airplane took off he subject had fastened verb before connector the airplane subject took off his past simple verb and fastening seat belt comes always before the airplane take off so it's normal for the past perfect to happen before the past simple so 10 is correct as you can see it's just a rule you follow taking care of half plus past participle present perfect or past perfect what comes after that and how would you put this sentence in order you have just to take care of the meaning of the sentence knowing that all the time past perfect happened before another past simple action and present perfect something happened in the past but continues up till now or its results at least continues till now work hard and take care of yourselves until I see you in another episode goodbye